Hey awesome gamers, welcome back to Joystick News. Today we're diving into the world of power to talk about a super useful construction, the stone bed. This is going to be a game changer for you base. Don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe for more power tips. Let's get started. So the stone bed in power is all about making your life easier. Once you set it up, you can say goodbye to the hassle of mining stone manually. Your bio will do all the heavy lifting for you, freeing you up to focus on other important tasks in the game. First thing first, to build a stone pit, you need to reach level 7, which is pretty easy in the early stage of the game. Just keep defeating enemies and catching new boss to level up quickly. Be sure to save your technology points because you need two of them to unlock the stone pit blueprint. Once you reach the right level and have the necessary technology point, head to the technology tab in your inventory. Here you can unlock the blueprint for the stone pit. But wait, there is more. You also need some resource to build it. 10 pallium uh, fragment, 20 wood and 15 stone. After gathering your materials, head back to your base, open the production tab, find the stone pit option and start building. It's way faster if you have some pals around you to help you out. Now, here is a pro tip. Just building the stone pit isn't enough. To actually get it working, you need to assign pals to it, and not just any pals. Those with the mining traits are your best bet. A good early game option is Kativa. Just open your pal docs and assign your mining pals to the base. And there you have a folk setting up and using a stone pair in power is that simple. Now you can focus on exploring and enjoying the game while your balls take care of the mining. If you found this guide helpful, give it a, a thumb up and don't forget to subscribe for more power tips and tricks. Until next time, keep gaming and stay awesome.